hope you're all doing well. This is Swedish for spread love and subscribe. I added that last part. Uh, today we're taking a closer look at the uh, Konkin backpack. Well, the difference between this one and the other ones is the inside. So inside this backpack, you can be an uh, undercover filmmaker or photographer and just blend in in the crowd by using this backpack and then the photo insert that you got in here. So in here you can keep your camera, your lenses, and that's what we're going to talk about today. So inside the bag you fit a microphone. This is a pretty big one. A really big camera as well. This is the uh, S1H. So it's also a pretty big camera. And then deep down here we have two extra lenses. Big one, this one, and a smaller one. So you're able to fit a pretty big kit in here. On the lid here, you got a mesh pocket so you can see if you need extra cables, memory cards and whatnot. Keep that safe and sound there. And on the top here, you've got another compartment if you need extra cables or whatever. You can uh, modulate the inside of the bag with these walls here. So you can construct it for the way that suits you and, and the things that you have inside the bag. Right now we fit the microphone and all the lenses and all that stuff in a perfect way and nothing will scratch towards against each other. As you can see, you connect the little walls here with Velcro, so it's super adaptable. You can fit it in everywhere, and then it's when you want to take it out, you just undo it like that. So it's really neat that so you can adapt it to your needs. So the photo insert itself comes with a handle up here on top, and then you got two loops here on each side, so you can use it as a shoulder bag if you'd like to do that. And then it slides perfectly in, fits with this version of the backpack, and then you go close it up real tight and snug and just like that you're good to go there's a smaller photo insert if your uh, kit is not that big this is the smaller version so you can see the difference between the two here just like that and this obviously gives you extra room for a small tripod if you want that in your uh, backpack or a uh, jacket or whatever and in here we actually have the uh, or food yeah or food we have the drone with us you can see that you, this is the Mavic Pro 2 big compartment here as well one where in this one you have two you can fit uh, three batteries remote the drone itself and again you're able to uh, perfectly blend in got the handle same as here on top so you can also carry this one as a, on the side here with the loops. So putting the photo insert to the side a little bit, let's go through the Konken backpack itself. It's a pretty open and roomy backpack just as it is. On the inside of this version, you have a little uh, higher quality uh, G1000 uh, sitting pad. So if you want to sit when you're outside on a rock or when you're working or you want to go down on your knees maybe to take a shot, this is a perfect way to keep your clothes clean and your butt clean as well. It sits here in the uh, compartment on the inside here. And you can write your name and all that stuff, of course, here too. The interesting thing about this backpack though comes here in the back and this is why these two are, is a great combo if you're a photographer or a filmmaker and you're on the go and again if you want to be a little bit undercover and you don't want to flex your expensive camera gear this is a great way to hide everything so in the back here you got a computer compartment just take that one out there this is a, actually a 16 inch computer and it fits perfectly fine here in the back side of the backpack so again you can really fit all your essentials for a day of shooting or filming in this backpack moving on to the sides you have uh, two compartments one on each side for uh, uh, an umbrella or a smaller water bottle if you like and then on the front just close it up here and on the front you got a extra compartment or pocket on the outside for uh, I don't know in this case we have uh, filters and keys and all that stuff here if you just for things that you quickly want to reach to
accessory that showed up is the rain cover for the Konkan backpack. So I thought I'd show you guys how it looks with that one on. And yeah, this is how it looks with uh, the rain cover on. Uh, so with this accessory, you'll be able to survive the Swedish summers. If you guys know what I mean. There's one thing that I would wish uh, that this bag had would have. It would be bigger side pockets. They are, with, uh, with the way it is now, it's pretty tight to to fit any extra stuff in here. What I mean by that, by that is if you take a look at the Ulva roll top that we've also covered on this channel, you see that with a stretch here on the side, you can fit so much more, maybe an extra lens or a bigger bottle. And with a little security pocket like this, you can keep your keys and all that stuff safe and uh, sound in there as well. And uh, yeah, I just think that this would be a great, um, if one could wish, this is something that I would wish for here. Uh, because yeah again this is a little bit tight here if you have any comments questions or any thoughts at all you can uh, write them down below and i'll see if i can answer that as soon as possible and yeah subscribe if you haven't already we do the occasional review we do adventures and all that stuff so yeah more of that to come and uh yeah you can follow me on instagram as well we do occasionally post there as too that's pretty much it for uh this time i hope i've got everything in here now and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Be safe.